is to simply right click the start button and then select device manager. From there, go ahead and click where it says display adapters. And there you go, as you can see, it tells you your graphics card. From there, simply right click your graphics card and then click update drivers. So now at this point, Windows will give you the option to automatically search for new drivers. This means Windows will automatically search, download and install the new drivers for your graphics card. Now when doing this, Windows may actually display that the latest drivers have already been installed, but this is not always true. And this takes us to the best way to update your graphics card, which is the second way, is to cut out the middleman, cut out Windows entirely and download the drivers directly from your manufacturer. And I have links to all of these drivers directly from the manufacturer in the video description, so please go there to check them out. Now step by step, Nvidia, AMD and Intel, let me show you how to get the drivers for each one. If you have an NVIDIA graphics card, simply head over to the NVIDIA drivers download page. Again, you can find that in the video description. Alright, so now once you are in the NVIDIA drivers download page, go to where it says product type. From there, you can choose which category your graphics card is in, whether it's a GeForce, Quadro, and so on. In my case, mine is a GeForce because I have the GeForce 1660 Ti. And the product series it's obviously the 16 series and i have a laptop so for notebooks and uh, product there you go the gtx 1660 ti and that's it it's all set so now all i have to do is click search and there you go it's going to locate the driver that is specific specific and most up to date to my graphics card and alternatively, if you have an NVIDIA GeForce graphics card, you can use the GeForce Experience feature, which also I have a link to that in the video description. Well, what if you have an AMD graphics card? That's actually at times even easier because AMD provides the best of both worlds. It has a tool that automatically detects which graphics card you have and then gets you the latest drivers for that specific graphics card. Or as another option, AMD also gives you the option to take things into your own hands and download the drivers specifically yourself. Okay, so now what if you don't have a discrete dedicated graphics card and you only have Intel integrated graphics? Well, happily, Intel does provide a free driver scan that automatically detects which driver you have and then installs it for you. For Intel, I recommend going that route because Intel has a lot of drivers and so this makes the whole process overall easier for you. And there you go, that's it. This is how you can easily update any graphics card on Windows 11. For more videos like this that are simple and straight to the point, please subscribe and thanks for watching.